Be prepared to be completely humiliated and violated. It's the worst nightmare of my whole life. I don't know, it's so scary. <laughs> He didn't do anything. Oh, that's that's messed up, but it could never happen to me. Yes, it could. It could happen to you, just like that. What we see on most TV shows is not reality. I was so frightened. Are you going to be a victim? No, I ain't going to be a victim. That means I got to be the victimizer. I wasn't in San Quentin a week, and I watched a man die right next to me. I'm on my bunk, and I'm listening to it, and I'm thinking, damn, ain't somebody going to come help this dude? It's more like a horror show. Just ask for an attorney. Don't blindly trust authority figures. Be ready to stand your ground. You're gonna need money. Pray for a miracle. They take a bad situation and they usually make it much worse. And you turned me into a murderer because I had to. I'm sorry. All the data luckily is out there. It's just a matter of whether you give it. We're gonna get perspectives from investigative journalists, analysts, academics, prison staff, lawyers, cops, inmates. So in the unfortunate case that this may happen to you, this is the Survivor's Guide to Prison. Hi, it's Valer here with a bonus behind the scenes movie fact for you. In the movie, The Shawshank Redemption, remember the scene where the character Brooks uh, feeds uh, his crow a maggot? Well, the American Humane Association objected to the scene and stated it was cruel to the maggot. And uh, it required that the crow be fed a maggot that had died from natural causes. Yeah. Okay, now, uh, before I go, remember, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. Bye-bye.